Today we shall reflect on the life of Saint Theodosius the Cenobiarch. Saint Theodosius of Cappadocia spent 30 years as a hermit in the so-called cave of the Magi between Jerusalem and Bethlehem. His sanctity, however, kept attracting such a growing number of disciples that he finally had to erect a large monastery for them in the desert of Juda by the Dead Sea, the first monastic establishment under the rule of Saint Basil. In the course of time, it grew to the size of a small city and contained numerous large workshops for various crafts besides five hospitals for the many sick infirm and lunatics for whom the monks cared there were three separate churches for the greeks the armenians and the arabs to recite the divine offices in their respective tongues while a fourth one served the penitents who had not yet been reconciled there was also ample accommodation for guests and on certain days a hundred tables were set for them alone divine providence saw to all their needs and intervened in a miraculous way at the time of a famine to justify the unbounded faith of saint theodosius the patriarch of jerusalem made theodosius the head of all monks living in common while saint sabas was set over the hermits to keep the thought of death constantly before him he used a freshly dug grave as a center for meditation he went to his reward in the year 529 in the 105th year of his life